Hey guys, just a short video. If you own one of these 50 watt uh, blue and white lasers, um, you know the working area is under 12 inches on your uh, on your Y, and your X is uh, under under 20 inches. There's a way if you just if you need if you need 12 inches going this way, which I did for a couple jobs. If you look at um, where my uh, head lies now. It's really close to this edge. I did it so I got all the way up because now I could put material all the way up to get 12 inches height for sure because I work with a lot of material that's 12 by 20 or 12 by 24. Um, I'm sorry, 20, eight, uh, 10 by 20 or 12 by 20. That's what I do. So when I need something that's got to be a full tuna, uh, 20, what I'll do is you got this much room left to bring that over okay and the same applies for the for the Y you have all this space here and I went just enough to before I hit that bar so that gives me 12.7 inches on my on my uh, X, uh, Y sorry so I can put a full 12 but I can only go I can only go right to before this touches this plate which uh, I got an extra 2.3 millimeters out of that but if I need to go longer then I can change it so I can get the a full inch over 20 inches if I'm not doing 12 tall so if you want to get if you're looking to get an extra uh, inch for your Y all you have to do is this go to your file and already works it's already open so I'll redo it here go to file go to vendor settings if it asks for a password, just put the RD8888 password, and then you'll get to this screen. You can look at my X here. It says 19.75. That's what I have it set at. On my Y, I have 12.7 inches for my height. If you put it there, you're not going to hit. But if your machine's built exactly the same, it won't hit. But I would, what I would do is just do small increments at a time, like 0.100. I got mine set up for inches also, not uh, millimeter. So if you look in the board here, because I set it up, see it's 322, 322 millimeters for my Y. And my X, it's 502.3 millimeters. So I get a little bit extra on the on the X as well. But on the Y, you really benefit because you get that extra um, inch. So um, that's all you gotta do. And then you just, first hit read. It'll tell you exactly what your settings are. Hit read and then change it. And then you hit write and then it'll ch it'll change it update it in the uh, controller on the laser so now I could throw a piece of 12 by 12 a, a full 12 by 12 sheet and work from corner to corner as before I can only do 11.7 11.7 ish to 12 so this way you know a lot of common sizes run in 12 in foot increments so um, just a little tip for you guys to uh, get a little extra space out of your uh, 50 watt uh, machine and like I said if you wanted to go a little bit longer then you don't need the 12, but you need the 20. Do the same thing. Raise it up this way so you clear that that block there. And then you can get a little, little bit longer if you need it. Um, so that's pretty much it. I don't know why they didn't utilize all that space. Nothing's interfering. It works all the way up into that area, especially here. This all clears. So, I mean, an extra inch this way. So now my machine is a, is a, a solid 12 by 7 uh, height on the Y. So... That's it. Thanks for watching, guys.